Hello and welcome to my first Nations Cup or at least Nations Cup video. I've done some of these before and I haven't done well. This one is going to be taking place at the Kyoto Driving Park 2. Before we get to the race, I've got a couple fumbles that I've got to show you guys from my uh, warm-up and my qualifying. Ooh, too much. <laughs> That's one way to start it. Let me out. Hey. I'm going. I didn't react well. Will that be a penalty? I don't know. <laughs> Funnily enough, uh, that was on my fastest qualifying lap. No! <gasps> oh, dude, there it is. The Ripperoni. Am I actually going to get fourth? I'm in fourth. <laughs> Would you look at that? <laughs> I'm off of the podium by two seconds, which uh, I think I could have done it. I could have. I think I could have gotten the podium. That was a, a bit of a surprise qualifying, but more surprising than that. Um, just, just watch. <laughs> Oh, fuck. I fucked it up. I fucked it up so badly. <laughs> I can't believe it. Or maybe I can. I forgot that this was a self-start and not just a launch-it-yourself kind of race. I hear him. Hello viewer, I started in fourth and then in one turn ended up in wherever I am right now. Oh. Why isn't he ghosted? That wasn't completely my fault, I couldn't do anything there. It was partially my fault though. I'm sorry yellow. I slowed down there just to make sure. I wonder who's watching. I can't see comments, so I won't be able to know until the end of the race. And now I've crashed into a wall. You know. Just uh, professional racing driver things, and now uh, I've goofed it again. I don't know how I keep doing this. Maybe I do. Maybe I should just stop talking. I probably should. Come on, just hold the slide. Okay. We are the last place. <laughs> I 
So fuel will be fine. It's just tires I feel like that we need to worry about. We're on softs. Yeah, this corner is literally death. Yep, only just made it through that chicane, not corner. This upcoming section is actually one of my favorite parts. You're flat out through most of it, and uh, to make it around this corner, all you need to do is lift the right time. Only problem is, in the next series of corners, it's pretty hard to follow people through. Yeah! Too slow. Will I die here? I'm gonna lift. Boop. Yep, I died there. I'm not supposed to break there, but hey, each their own, I guess. What am I supposed to do? I'm in last. Not my race anymore. Well, this looks pretty bad. Um, I am pretty bad at the game. So, no point in quitting out here. Um, I actually charge on and try and catch up with the pack. Um, I'm gonna skip a little bit forward towards the action since, uh, I have a lot of catching up to do. As you rejoin, I think we're about a lap later. Um, I finally caught up to the back of the pack. I'm gonna die. <laughs> I'm gonna die for sure. There's nothing I can do here. Excuse me. Yeah, I probably... I'm not sure if I gave him enough room there. This is the same scenario where I just died. Would you look at that? I only just went there and survived slotting in just behind the Dr. Pepper car. And hopefully making my return back into this race. <laughs> that didn't work. <laughs> See you though. Like through the last two corners, Dr. P wasn't ready to give up 17th so easily, and I only just fend off the P car. But at what cost? Now I'm going into the death chicane first. Okay, getting better there. We gap the Grand P by about 3.3 seconds. 
giving us some breathing room, which we could use to focus on passing this guy in 16th. I just scraped him, but I think that was a clean enough pass. It takes me a little while to catch up to 15th place, but two laps later, later I eventually do it. We rejoin to C15, pushing 14 wide and off the track. I didn't bump him, he just outbraked himself. And we're up into 14th. I literally just, just like, right there. Is that a racing move? I have, I'm not sure, but I feel good about it. Not really, I guess. If the driver just crashes out ahead of you, it's not like it's your skill there, is it? I did put the pressure on. The only thing is, if I could actually get this corner correct, man, would I be fast. Or fast enough here. That's an okay one. From what I remember of the laps I watched before doing this, I think you're supposed to try and get your outer two wheels like right up to the edge of the corner you're almost like halfway off of it uh, but I was not very good at that which is uh, why I end up going off so often at that chicane <laughs> this current set of quarters is what I was talking about earlier on in the race before I crashed you kind of almost like slide down it I don't really know how to describe it. It's really cool though. Oh man, we're up. I don't think we'll be able to get 10th, but maybe 12th. For now, I'm in the slipstream of number 13. And I just get my shot as he goes a little wide on that corner which allows me to catch up pretty quickly here trying to get him to go wide here he knows I'm there and almost as if I could see the future this guy just makes room for me It's a little bit sloppy, but I made the move work. And into the corner, though. <laughs> My confusion ended up killing him, I'm gonna say. That's how I beat him. <laughs> oh, man. Am I, like, the best worst driver? Since I crashed, uh, I would say no. I'm uh, probably not even <coughs> the best of the worst. But I guess uh, surviving and taking a position is something. Yeah. Why are these guys in the pits? Do we need to ch change tires? I don't think so, right? Well, I'm about to find out. And why are they fueling up? I mean, I get it's a long race, but uh... While I was talking, I nearly overshot that corner.
even though it doesn't look like it. I did some practice races before this and didn't need to change tires. Also when it comes to fuel, from the second telemetry display on the left of the screen, you can see that even in the final laps of this race, I'll have plenty of fuel to finish. Now we're coming up on the danger chicane. And uh, since we've made up all these positions from uh, crashing out into last, I should really be focusing on being careful here. Let's see how I do. Yeah. That wasn't awful. I'm nearly a minute off of first. That does feel bad. Uh oh. Am I going too fast here? Oh, I shaved some speed off, so it's okay. No passing. What? Rip. Monkey D. I'm up into 11th place, maybe 10th. Maybe 10th is a thing. So, check out how far I am to 10th and the differential on the left. I'm uh, about 4 seconds right now, which kind of looks bad right now. But, so far, the upcoming chicane has claimed quite a few drivers this race, including myself. So, maybe this time, if I survive it, I could be up into 10th place. Here we go. Okay, so here, we gotta be braced to be able to pick up one of, the, one of these guys' positions because there is a chance. Yep, there is a chance, isn't there? Where am I going? See ya. I'm not sure about that move, but it's stuck. You know what? I will go back and check on that move. We have the technology. So, as we see here, it was a pretty clean dive, tons of space between us, but as you can see from the radar on the right, the guy dives towards me, and I think there's slight contact, but I still pulled it off. Very wide there. Will ninth be a thing? Come on. I wonder what happened to first. He lost 10 seconds. I don't know if you noticed from my voice earlier, but uh, the pressure is definitely starting to get to me as I do a little slide right there. Ninth place is back in the picture. Falling from last place, it's been quite the comeback, and uh, let's see if I can keep the ball rolling. It's the second to final lap, and we're coming up on the hardest part of the track for myself. Will I make it? Track extend! <laughs> Here we go! Ninth or eighth, maybe? We'll see. We just gotta survive this corner twice more. The old bumpy boy.
ninth and eighth are having a bit of a fight. Will I end up in the split slip screen? Slip stream? Maybe. It looks like we've only just gotten the slipstream, and uh, ninth place seems to be a little bit frazzled by their fight with eighth. And uh, will I be able to make a move? Nope, not here. Still gonna try and hold off. This guy is a little, a little bit. Come on. You got this man. Fred, you gotta go get eighth. Come on. I'm a little bit too deep for my own good, but hey. Come on, Fred. You could have taken that corner a little bit better. And I could have taken that last corner a little bit better, so we both got some stuff to improve on. My tires are a little balding. Yeah, okay. We survived. All we've got to do now is not screw up. And I'll be able to bring it back to ninth place from last. Recovering a total of 10 positions. Oh. No. That was bad. Come on, little monster. A little butt clench in action back there. Um, I'm not sure why, but uh, near the end of the race, for some reason, I've decided to push. <laughs> push a lot harder, as you, you're about to see and hear the tires just complaining and me drifting quite wide there. But I finally made it. Hey, that's a recovery. Ten positions from last. Will we get points? I don't know. And I didn't get to keep fourth. <laughs> so there, there's that. Oh man. Oh, well, that was fun. Well, that's my first points. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed watching me race. Uh, it's uh, definitely eventful, I'd say. And uh, see you next time.